fact that Florida is trying to carry this torch to end Roe v. Wade is disgusting. It is something that Floridians did not ask for. State lawmakers approved the item Thursday night in a vote that went down party lines. 23 yeas, 15 nays, Mr. President. The bill would go into effect in July. The only exceptions are to save a mother's life, prevent serious injuries, or if the fetus has a fatal abnormality. There are no exceptions for victims of rape, incest, or human trafficking. These are folks uh, that are being forced to carry pregnancies through trauma. Governor Ron DeSantis is committed to signing it. I think the protections are, are warranted, and uh, I think that uh, we'll, be able to, uh, we'll be able to sign that in short order. Some Republican lawmakers stated their their positions. Okay, after 15 weeks, um, that is a child. I was adopted, you know, and I could have been, you know, I could have been on the other side of this argument also. So when you think about being pro-life, um, we're we're giving 15 weeks. Some Democrats are calling the bill wrong. There's something just off or wrong about a male-dominated legislative body making a decree like this.